हेलो फ्रेंड्स काइंडली सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल गौर मन भोस चैनल दैट विल हेल्प यू इन लर्निंग मैथमेटिक्स फॉर क्लास ट्वेल्व सी बी एस एग्जामिनेशन इट इज वेरी इजी टू अंडरस्टैंड फ्रॉम द वीडियो टुडे आई डिस्कस ए थ्योरम दैट्स कम फ्रॉम द डिटर्मिनेंट चैप्टर फोर ऑफ क्लास ट्वेल्व एन सेट बुक द थियोरम इज A square matrix is invertible if and only if a non-singular matrix. So this is very simple way. That is, a square matrix A is invertible if and only if A is a non-singular. If this one is given, then you have to this so. If this one is yes given, then you saw this one. This is the meaning of if and only if. Let us proceed. Proof. Case one. Let A be invertible matrix. Then show that A is a non-singular matrix. So here A is a invertible matrix is given. Then as per the definition of invertible matrix, there exists a square matrix B. Of same order, such that a b equal to b a equal to i. So this is the definition of invertible matrix. Now you take the determinant of both sides. Determinant of this one, this one, and this one. Then what happen? A b whole determinant equal to a is equal to one. Also we know a theorem. A b whole determinant. Equal to a determinant and b determinant. So what we got? The product of a determinant and b determinant is one. Since we know that the product of two determinant is one, then none of these will be zero. Therefore, a is not equal to zero. That means a is non-singular matrix. A determinant is not equal to zero, so A is non-singular matrix. Now, case two. Now we have to show in case two. Just reverse of case one. That is, A is non-singular matrix. Then show that A is invertible matrix. Is A is a non-singular matrix, so A determinant will not be zero. We also know one of the statement that that a into adjoint matrix adjoint matrix into a equal to a determinant i. This is one of statement we know that since a determinant is not equal to zero, so we divide a determinant with all the terms with this with this with this. Then what happen? Then we have we have A into adjoint A divided by A determinant, adjoint A into A by A determinant, A determinant by A determinant. So what happen? A into adjoint A by A determinant, adjoint A by A determinant into A. Here A determinant will cancel. That will be I. So this is just the form of A B into B A equal to I. That means A inverse will be B. Now compare these two. What happen? You have you have A. This is your B. This is your B. This is your A. That equal I. So A inverse will be this much. So A inverse equal to adjoint A by A determinant. So you got this. That means. A is invertible matrix. A is invertible matrix. A is invertible matrix. Hence, we prove the theorem. A square matrix A is invertible if and only if A is non-singular matrix. Thank you. So, you all are requested to subscribe my channel, Gaurav Mangal's channel. Which help you in coming CBC board exams. Thank you.